Okay, now we're going to talk about freezing the specimen and preparing the block for cutting. So we're going to cut a piece of tissue here. This is muscle. The molds are kept in the cryostat. Take the mold out at the very last minute so that it doesn't warm up. Now when you put the tissue into the mold, you need to make sure that you control the tissue the whole way. Anywhere that you touch the tissue, it's going to stick. So uh, control the tissue and make sure that you place the tissue in the center of the mold so that you have a border of OCT around the outside and you're going to need that in order to tease off the section as you're cutting it. Try and do it in one motion. So I'm going to touch it right there and I'm going to flatten it down. So now I have space around here which is about a three to five millimeter border around the outside. I'm going to take my OCT and my chuck, fill this up to overflowing when you put the block on top of this thing, you want the OCT to ooze out from between these grooves, which is going to help the block adhere to this and it won't pop off inadvertently. So, got that there, I press it down firmly. Oops. Bring this over, put it into the prior stick, hold this down, and spray it. If you spray it, it'll freeze a lot more quickly than just letting it freeze by itself. I'm going to put a blade in. And this in the meantime is continuing to freeze. I'm going to tighten this up. I'm going to move this uh, blade so that we start uh, on the end right here. And as we continue to cut, we'll slide this down as this portion of the blade becomes dull. So I'm going to tighten it down. So these levers are all tight. I've checked this right here. This is going to be 5 microns. So I took this out of here. I have excess OCT. I'm going to break it off. So I'm going to make sure this is frozen. I'm spraying the block a little bit. I'm going to place the block into the holder and position it to cut. Now I've put it on this angle right here because generally when you're cutting tissue you want to cut from soft to hard or small to large uh, and that will just facilitate the cutting. Now I'm looking at the controls and I see that this little light is lit up which means that the block holder has retracted all the way back to the home position. I'm going to hold this rapid advance button down for about 10 seconds which is going to bring this thing out about 5 millimeters and you can see that this has advanced the block pretty close to the knife right here. And as I bring it down in position, I'm testing to find out where the block is. I'm starting the trimming, the facing process. And now you can see that the entire surface is being cut, shaved. So now I'll spin the wheel to get a feel for the consistency of the tissue. Is it frozen enough? What is the density? Is there fat on one side? Is there skin on another? Is it uniform in density? Which will all help to determine how, what adjustments I'm going to make. So I'm going to take a look at a section. The brush should always be cold. So if you're using your brush, put it down until you're actually going to take your section. So, and, and if the brush gets warm, spray it. The reason is, of course, that the brush, if it's warm, will grab onto the OCT melt and ruin the section. So now I'm going to start spinning this wheel and see what it looks like. I'm grabbing the, spat, the OCT just as it's coming off and then very delicately pulling the section down as I'm cutting. And so now when I've taken the section, you notice too that I don't separate it from the block. This is still attached right up here. And that allows you to be able to manipulate the section a little bit. Now while I'm holding this down, the, there's static electricity inside the cryostat. And these sections will jump up onto the slide if you don't hold them down. So I'm going to pick this section up. And you see I'm holding this slide uh, very firmly. And I have a lot of control over it. Put my thumb on the face right here and then slowly bring the slide to the specimen. 
And so there's our section right there. And if you want to make sure that you get it into the alcohol right away.